The question is this, can you delete a review that you get, that you get on your Google business profile? I'm going to show you the answer in this video. So here's my Google business profile right here. I'm logged in as Teddy Burris and I have access to my Google business profile. And you can see I have nine Google reviews. If I click on that, brings up a, a pop-up box and I can see these nine reviews. Now, what can I do with these nine reviews? First of all, I can hit the like button or I can respond as I did already. I responded right here. Furthermore, I can edit my response or delete my response. However, I, I cannot delete this review. If you look under the three dots, I have two options. I can share the review or I can report the review. Now, if I report the review, this is what comes up. What are you, why are you reporting this review? And I have these options, off topic, spam, conflict, profanity, bullying, discrimination, or personal information. Those are the options I have here. Furthermore, and I'm, by the way, I don't want to do that, but furthermore, I can see right here you know, that when I, I clicked on the three dots right here and I got help and under help, it tells me a little bit more about what this prohibited and restricted content in regards to reviews is all about. And so I can see that all of these are inappropriate content and behavior, but this is what I don't see. What I don't see is I don't see what's going to happen. It very clearly says that it, the, the system does, does not want this type of engagement, but it doesn't tell me what is going to happen with that review. I kind of hope that it goes away. Uh, removed and rejected content for policy violations. What's that going to do for me? We sometimes remove content. Doesn't say we always do. Sometimes remove content. So the bottom line is, I can't remove it. I could report it. I'm just not definitive about when you report it, does it get removed? Gotta hope that if you sincerely and transparently report inappropriate content, not just a negative review, you can't make negative reviews go away, but if they violate the terms and services of Google, then there is a potential for it to be removed. Now, let me answer the bigger question. The bigger question is, how do I get rid of negative reviews? My only less than 100% positive review is from Carol, who gave me four stars out of five two years ago. Now, the only way to get rid of that is to get more positive reviews. And the bottom line is what it does, it doesn't really get rid of it. It just pushes it down out of the way and puts more, hopefully, if you get it, more positive reviews on top. There is one other option, and that is you could ask the person who wrote that review a less than glaring positive review. You could ask them to edit the review. Now, will they? Don't know. You're going to have to address their reasons for writing a less than stellar review. Can show you an example here. Here's my friend's action coach, Team Hauser. They're in Winston-Salem, and you can see right here, they have 23 Google reviews. If I click on that, you'll see I can edit my review. So I can bring my review up, and then I can adjust the stars, and or I can uh, add more, you know, what I like about them, and click on these other two icons if I want to, and I can edit my text. Furthermore, I could add photos. But the bottom line, the only way you're going to get someone to edit a review and make it better for you is you're going to have to clearly address the reasons that they gave you a less than fantastic review. And additionally, you're going to have to make some kind of concessions with them, uh, i.e. give them something in a meaningful way that would encourage them to do this. Now, I'm not a fan of paying for reviews, but I am an advocate for having a conversation with someone who gave you a less than great review and find out if they would be willing to alter or rewrite their review, their review in any way. I'm Teddy, your Google Workspace and Gmail guy. I hope this is helpful for you.